Another project, this porch light. It's been burnt out for, I don't know, four years. It's all corroded. This orange color comes out pretty easy, just pop underneath here. So you can see it's all corroded up in here. So I'm gonna pull this all out, and replace it with a new one, it's an LED. I'm gonna have to figure out, there's one problem, my LED is a bit smaller than where the holes, the mounting holes for this one is. So I've got to make another hole and patch a hole. I recently bought a new tool. Let's give this guy a try and cut around the seal. Hey, okay. just like that, the little guy comes out. So just to assemble this one, clean up the area. Here I put in the new one. Got a plastic scraper to keep from scratching this too badly. Go ahead with a little goo gone. I think it's more this adhesive off. Once again, default to my fingernail. Okay, right, so the final cleanup. Use nice propyl alcohol to get the goo gone off the side. And all the little extra little pieces of adhesive that's kind of everywhere. Uh, I'm probably just trying to figure out how I want to, where exactly I want to mount this, what screws I want to use. Alright, so I just gotta fix my wires, get ready to splice them together with the new light. Now I've gotta patch at least two of these holes and make a third hole. Correction, a fourth hole. But you can see when he built these things, they didn't do a very good job of lining up where they're gonna put these wires. Alright, back to work. Okay, a couple of issues. I need to get this wire out from behind this plate so it'll mount flush to the RV. The other problem I'm having is the original screws and the screws that came with this aren't quite long enough I think for what I need to do. So if I use the screws they gave me, it sticks out far enough I would think to get through the wall and hold onto the wall. But I gotta make bigger holes and I, don't, I still don't see, I don't know, maybe. And if I use the original screws, with the other light fixture, not enough threads that come out when I use them. The well's too deep for these screws, so I'm gonna have to put the thinking cap on and come up with a solution. I think I'm just gonna have to go and find some longer screws. I don't quite make it out with this lighting, but it's pretty, pretty sealed up in there. Don't have to worry about water damaging the electronics. I freed up the cord. So now the cord is not in the way when I try to mount this thing flush. Just gotta put the screws back in. Alright, there we go. The light works. Just need to fish on electric, tape these up, shove it into the wall, mount it. So I have some plastic weld, a little putty type stuff. I'm gonna putty up the holes so I don't have to worry about them leaking into the wall when it rains. So new lights installed, the lights on, works. You can see where I had to repair the hole from the old one, the light figure was bigger. I had to patch that hole up too. And I put a sealant around the edge. So that's, that's in there, I ain't going nowhere. Nice and bright. 